Hi and welcome to Lancaster House. I'd like to give you a tour today. My name is Miss Brooks and I'm the Head of Boarding and Wellness. So come on in and you'll see what we've got to offer in boarding. So this is Lancaster, welcome. Um, we're really proud that it's actually, it's a home from home. Um, so we have, a, uh, we have a little dog here and his name is Harvey. And um, at the moment we have lower six pupils in house. So that is in sixth form. So these are some of our sixth form girls. And this is one of our common rooms. And this common room is used for uh, more working and uh, reading and things. We've also got a piano which the girls quite like to come and play on. Every boarding house has a piano. It's very important to us that um, girls get to practice their, their music and so on. So they do like to spend some time in here. If you just come on through, we've got another common room and this one's more of our relaxation lounge. So we have um, things like movie nights, the girls come in and, and play cards. Uh, we have pamper nights where the girls wear masks and so on. Um, so it's quite nice to come in here after school and just relax. At the weekends we do actually have trips and activities. So if you're interested in going to places like Alton Towers, which is obviously a theme park, we go ice skating, trampolining. Um, we also take the girls to really lovely local places like York. Um, and that's quite a, a lovely place to visit. We also go to cities as well, so Leeds is quite close by. Um, so we make sure that the girls have lots to do and it's really important that um, we really take them to some of these places to show them some of the UK culture and to help them specifically if they are overseas pupils to develop their English language. So if you'd like to come up here, I'll just show you some of the girls' bedrooms. Some girls are a little bit different. Some girls like to have their own bedroom and some girls like to share. And what we try and do is we ask you what your personal preference is. So if you prefer to share uh, with, with another girl, that's absolutely fine. But some girls quite like to study independently on their own and so therefore we try and give them their own bedroom. When you get into upper six in sixth form, every pupil has their own bedroom. So that's quite important. So this is a room for two girls and obviously you can see they have their own study desks, their own space and um, it's really important, you know, we make sure that, that the girls get on and that they are good friends um, and everybody here, everyone's like sisters so we really are just like a big family so we do make sure um, that, that all of the girls are happy and that they do feel at home with where they're placed. I'll show you a slightly bigger room. Um, all of our bedrooms are quite bright. That's very important to us. We want to make sure that the girls um, have access to light. Their well-being is really important. And I think what's quite nice, particularly about Harrogate, is that it's quite a green place. So there's lots of trees, um, lots of grass, lots of greenery. And I think what's nice about some of these rooms is, is the views. So you can see we have tennis courts in school um, and the girls quite like to just sit outside, sitting on the benches. They read outside. We have picnics outside. So they do often put their blankets down and we all just tend to um, relax. And I think because it's such a nice space outside, um, the girls really find that the outside is an extension of, of this house. And it's very similar in the other three houses as well. We all have our own garden, we all have our own space. Um, so it is really important that we encourage the girls to use that outside space as well. So if we take you downstairs, I will take you to the kitchen, which is probably one of the favourite rooms for the girls, particularly in this house because they like to cook. Uh, we bake, we do weekend activities, uh, we, we make cupcakes, we uh, make pancakes, um, we have dinners together on a Friday and a Saturday, so it really has that family feel. Um, here's Harvey again. <laughs> <laughs> we, we try and celebrate as many cultural events as possible, so we have Nigerian girls in-house and we celebrate Nigerian Independence Day, we have Chinese girls in-house and they cook Chinese food, so it's really important that the girls do use this space and we find out a little bit about them as well. 
So this is our kitchen and some of our girls make cupcakes and um, some of the girls come uh, when they come back from school they make themselves a drink, they grab a snack and um, of course they always come and talk to house staff so I'm here 24-7, I live here all the time um, as well as my assistant house mistress so at any point the girls know that they can come and grab us and even if it's during the night as well uh, we're always here for them so that's really important. At the weekends on a Friday and Saturday in particular, we tend to eat in the kitchen. Again, it's just to really reinforce that family feel. It's a really nice time uh, for the girls and for staff as well. So we do, we come and eat in here. If we're not in here, we do eat over at the school. And um, so it just depends what day it is. But this is our kitchen. And after that, you've pretty much seen all of the house, particularly our social spaces. We've got an office as well where we are always based and when the girls do come home from school at half past four, they're always welcome to come and sit on our couch and we really enjoy asking them how their day has been. I mean, it's really important that their, their well-being is looked after. Thank you for joining us on a tour of Lancaster House. I hope you enjoyed it and we look forward to seeing you very soon.